Hey guys, it's I, Power here, doing another unboxing slash figure review. This time from Dragon Ball Super, Dragon Ball Flash series, uh, three figure set featuring uh, Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, Super Saiyan Blue Goku, and Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black. This right here is something I got back on my vacation that was gone for these past two weeks uh, that I picked up as a souvenir. And yeah, what's it called? Let's uh, do the unboxing video because I'm going to try to figure out how to unbox this without destroying the, uh, the box art. So let's see how that goes. Okay, folks, time to do the unboxing. Now, this thing's a little bit, uh, free, uh, trying to do this unboxing is going to be a little bit difficult. I'm going to try to open over here and hopefully not damage the box. Oh, yeah, that is kind of stuck over there. Oh, yeah, that is ripping what I did not want to rip, but you know what? That's happening. Oh, yeah, no, that is not going to be the way I want to do this, but you know what? That's fine. This is why we brought the exacto knife. This is going to be a little... Do not try this at home, folks. This is dangerous. Uh, only professionals should do this. And when I mean professionals, I mean people who know how to use knives. Okay, that's actually working out well. The box is doing well. Not destroying the box. Basically, priority number one. And yeah, that's actually working out well. I'm going to use the rest of the knife to try to... Oh, yeah, no, that's... Yeah, no, this, uh, I think we've, uh, made a whatnot. I do apologize for this. Don't wish to see this. This is terrible. I know, anybody seeing this right now is like saying, it's like they're praying for my fingers not to get hurt. But I think we got it. And, whew, the box is safe. So, we didn't destroy the box too much. Remember from the box, let's go with all the characters. Whew. Uh, we got Goku Vegeta and Goku Black all right here. Let's see if we try to sit all these guys up right now. We got these. So right here we got these token stands right here for them. Each of these featuring all the characters. Right here we got Vegeta. We have uh, basically Vegeta stand right here. Or it's a Vegeta coin that you can turn around and become the stand right there. And the little peg right here is where he stands. This one right here is Goku right here. See right here, I'm trying to show these as much as I can. This little stand right here. Oops, sorry guys. And this right here is Goku Black. See right there. I'm trying to make sure you guys can see like the artwork for this. And stand right there. So going off. You got Vegeta right here. Looking pretty nice design overall. I expected it. It's actually a pretty nice figure despite how uh, how cheap this is and how I bought it. I think it was like 10 bucks for the whole figure. But it is a movable figure. As you can see right here, it's ar Vegeta's arms are able to move up and down, no problem at all. And that's pretty much it. That's all the movement he has, which is the arms, which is fine. For these kind of figures, it's how they are. Now let's put him on his stand. And boom. Now let's go with Goku. Artwork-wise, he looks pretty nice in design. All Everything looks good detail-wise. So I figure all my figures to be looking good, and not gonna lie, I actually am kind of liking. No, uh, I like. There's one thing I do kind of like. I kind of like the color, or at least the blue wise, when it comes to figures. One, I kind of do not like how they have the colors in the uh, in the anime in the movie. Uh, and here's Goku Black right here, looking nicely designed right here, detailed as well. Despite being a very small figure and pretty cheap, he looks pretty nice for how he is. Oh, I'm trying to get a close shot right here. It is a little bit difficult. Yeah, there we go. You can see his mean little face right there. Looking good in his strip. And his arms able to go down. Ooh, he's able to spin. A little bit blockage on him when he goes, does a little spin, but you can move it around to do that. See right here, he has the, uh, the uh, earring, which I think is the fusion earring. And then we put him on his stand over here and boom now we have all of them on their stands looking good once it's cold oh sorry about that we're gonna put everybody up here in their stand Ooh. and Vegeta's already off his stand yeah I kind of figured these are still technically cheap figures so they're gonna be like that so we're gonna do these on rotations and whatnot 
Overall, I'm liking the. I am really liking the figures. Why not? For the amount uh, money that I, that I got these from, which I think was around like what ten bucks overall, it's a pretty good deal. I have no clue if these are in what's called if you can buy these states or whatnot. Because I bought these in Mexico. I'm probably I'm pretty sure you can and whatnot. But for the price they are, they look good. They're designed well. And yeah. Uh, but what's called, I'm enjoying the figures. And these guys will be right here with the rest of my Dragon Ball figures on display later down the line. But overall, uh, this is the end for my 3P set, Dragon Ball figure set. Featuring Goku, Vegeta, and Goku Black. Uh, this is Bud, this is Pyro, signing out, and I'll see you guys on the next one.